theater, theater, theater. You know, it sounds interesting, going up on stage and being an actor, but when you're in it, everyone seems a little bit off. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for my first day of theater. <laughs> yeah, we're very excited to have you too. You know, I always saw things about how theater kids are weird, but you guys are actually really cool. I'm so glad you noticed. But before we get started, there is one requirement. Okay, what's up? You're gonna have to let me smell your armpits. Hey, yo! Nah, bruh, and I was just offending you. Hey, what you rubbing your hands like that for? Back up, fool! Hey, back up! Yo! What's up, guys? It's your boy, Orange Guy Animations. And this is Theater Part 2! <laughs> I figured since I split the last video in half, why not continue one of my other stories? And if you remember the first theater video, everything wasn't always fun in games, and I wasn't having it anymore. So our first rehearsal for theater comes around, and off rip, I already know I'm not supposed to be there, bro. Oh my god! Because everyone already knew each other. And they were all hanging out, talking, and some of them were spitting bars already. And I was over there sitting in the corner, because I'm the newbie that doesn't know anyone. But hey man, it'd be like that sometimes. So we all gathered around the piano, and to begin our rehearsal, we would start with some vocal exercises. And after that, of course, we rehearsed the songs in the play. But during the whole practice, everybody was just awkwardly friendly, bro. So... First play, huh? Yeah... You know, I remember my first play, too. Please, stop this madness. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm just not a friendly person because all those conversations were very uncomfortable. But that's pretty much how every rehearsal was for a while. We would practice our songs, and every now and again I'd have an uncomfortable conversation. But as time went by, people started to inconsistently come to rehearsal, and our director was getting a little upset. <laughs> I I just don't understand how they expect me to direct a play if nobody's here! Yeah, she wasn't taking it too well. And it definitely didn't help that we were getting into some important stuff, like working with our choreographer, we were blocking certain scenes, and most importantly, getting our music touched up with the choir teacher. We were told this was the most important because the choir teacher and one of the guitarists were there to help on their own time. And there was a day where almost nobody went. The director was going crazy. You know, I don't know if the choir teacher was going crazy. She was always nice to me. But the theater teacher was yelling at everybody about how they need to be there. This, this can't be. It was getting bad, bro. And it's not like it was a bunch of background characters like me who weren't showing up. No! It would be the most important people who were just gone. Boy, ain't no way, bro. There was a couple times where I had to fill in for them so that the one important person who did show up could get good practice. Yes, sir. But every day, someone was complaining. Why is nobody getting things right? Why is no one coming to rehearsal? Uh, nya, 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 nya. Like, bro, shut up. Because honestly, man, we do not care. Everyone was just getting mad annoying in there, bro. And the worst part is they would put on this fake buddy buddy attitude when clearly something was bothering them. Shit, tripping. And then they would speak all passively aggressive too. Hey guys, great job in rehearsal today, even though some of your peers didn't show up. But you guys have some work to do as well. 
I don't want to say you guys are being lazy, but some of this stuff you should have down by now. Like, bro! If you're gonna be mad, then be mad! Everybody in there acting like clowns. But hey, I guess that's what you do in theater sometimes. <laughs> Luckily, we were going into winter break, and I was excited to do other things rather than deal with the circus after school. But when we came back from break, things were not the same. And let's just say, it didn't end on a happy note. But you'll have to find out about that another time. And with that being said, I'll catch you in the next video. Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy, End Cards Orange Guy. Woo, yeah, that's right. Another split in a story. Oh my gosh, no way. That's crazy, not again. Well, like I said before, I, I don't want to rush the video, bruh. There's so many details that I got to include this stinky story. But hey, man, when it's all out, it'll be in like one playlist. And for those of you who... uh are watching this after it's all out you know you get to just binge it all and it'd be a full story it's gonna be amazing immaculate even but uh yeah make sure you go check out oga drip shop it says it right there it's a pretty cool place and um subscribe uh your grandmother is definitely on life support and i will pull the plug if you don't subscribe <laughs> subscribe ah!